Hey guys, back for another review. And today I'm gonna do carrot cupcake because I realize I haven't had it for a while and I recently got Monster Mash, Monster Mash um, after I got carrot cupcake and I don't remember what the difference is. So I thought I better do a review of both. So this one is for carrot cupcake. It's been brewing for about five-ish minutes. Um, carrot cupcake. It's a rooibos tea. This sweet creamy blend of carrot ginger and warming spices is a real fall treat. Carrot rooibos, cocoa shells, cinnamon apple, ginger, licorice root, natural whipped cream, and apple flavoring. Use one to two perfect spoons per 16 ounces and you want to do it at 200 degrees for four to five minutes. This is caffeine free. And yeah, so it smells. Hmm. What does it smell like? What am I smelling? It's apple. It's like a really concentrated apple smell. Yeah, that's what it is. It's good though, it's very like Pow, it's very intense. So, let's get this going. I love this Nordic mug. It's so big. I've never been. And I have one other tea mug. And the little, like, filter thing. Like, this is so much easier to clean out. I don't know what they did differently with this. But it's like, it just... All we just like clean right out of this one versus other ones it's like it sticks more so I don't know what they're doing but they're doing something right so this hmm, smells like the first thing that hit was like apple cider but then it does t it does smell a lot like carrot after that let me try it again yeah it's like a mix of like apple it smells like and then carrot I mean you t you can smell like the cinnamon and stuff in there too subtly but like those are the two strongest all right here we go hmm okay so it's very sweet for sure um, gosh, this tastes just like something and I'm having such a hard time pinpointing it. Something that I've tried that is also liquid. It's really good, actually. Wow. This is better than I thought. Maybe I steeped it wrong the first time, but, um, I don't know. I guess it does taste like carrot cake. It tastes, I mean, you taste the apple. You taste quite a bit of apple. I think that's what I'm tasting. So first it's kind of like the apple cidery type of feel, and then it's like slowly the sweetness like sets in and it just like gets stronger and stronger and it hits you with like a really sweet aftertaste. I'm making it sound it tastes just like apple cider. It doesn't, okay? It definitely doesn't taste like apple cider or apples. There's definitely a way different taste to this. I'm just like not, <laughs> I'm not good at this kind of thing, so I probably shouldn't be doing it, but I'm having such a hard time. It's just that I smell the apple and I taste it too, but it's more just like that kind of sweetness at first. That's the sweet that I that I taste, but there's also the carrot in there and the cinnamon. I don't know. I'm having a hard time describing this, but it's really smooth and really sweet. And it's really good. It definitely is like a nice like fall. You can taste the tea in there too, which is what I really like. I really like the tea when you can actually taste the tea afterward. It's more of like, not the, the last taste. There's probably like technical terms for this, but it's like first taste is like the carroty apple, like natural sweet. Then a really sweet like sets in. So that's probably the Oh, it's the licorice root that I'm tasting too. Yeah, it doesn't taste licorice-y. It's very subtle, but you can tell that that's changing the flavor. Um, the ginger. It 
so the whipped cream and the apple flavoring so like the whipped cream like really sweet flavor kind of like sets in slowly in the middle and then the last hit that you get is like a very sweet tea taste it's like really long like process you get a lot it's like a long flavor story as soon as you sip it it's really good I think that I must have brewed this wrong or something the first time because I was like, yeah, that's good, but you know, whatever. But this time I'm like obsessed with this, so I might have to get more of this. I mean, it's like, I don't even really want, part of it might be because in my blueberry video I put, uh, I put cream in it and it curdled because there was whatever ingredient, I need to look up what ingredient, ingredients curdle milk in tea. And so I don't want to do that with this because it's so good, but I also don't really want milk in it. It might be a really good latte, I mean, probably most things are, but this one is just really good on its own. So I just don't want to like mess with it right now. I should try, I should do a latte for another one. But anyway, I'm actually really impressed with this carrot cupcake. Okay. Not sure if it's available online. I didn't see it online. The only reason I got this actually is in the store. I was overwhelmed and I thought I'd be able to get more samples than I was so I was just kind of like uh, like frozen and the people are like like wake up like stay with me and I was like okay but this random chick just came stomping into the store and she was like give me that carrot cupcake and I was like carrot cupcake that sounds amazing so I gave her a whiff and I was like let's throw that in into the pot because I know a lot of people who love carrot cake and I Part of my thing is like, not only do I get obsessed, but I really shove things down other people's throats. I'm one of the most irritating people you could probably ever be around. But anyway, I know like my dad loves carrot cake. And so I was thinking like, I should get some and, and have him try it. Cause I think, I don't know. I just like shoving my hobbies down other people's throats basically. But anyway, super impressed with this. I, I, I can't believe I don't know what happened, but I'm like really obsessed with this now. So this is going to probably be a, a mainstay for me. Thanks so much for watching and stay tuned for more videos, especially tea videos, because there's going to be several, but eventually I'll probably move on to my next obsession. But so maybe I should say stay tuned for next obsession video, but it's going to be tea. It's going to be a tea video.